A lot of school districts had a snow day today, but with the option now of virtual learning, could those snow days be a thing of the past? 39 on your side's Elena Holland spoke to some West Michigan school districts to see what they think. As a child, there are few better feelings than waking up to this, checking 13 on your side mornings, and realizing you have a snow day. But with virtual learning now an option, will that feeling be gone? For us, it was a combination of visibility uh, was very low, and the forecast of additional accumulation and uh, drifts really made the decision for us. Students at Coopersville area schools woke up to find a snow day Tuesday. You know, we had three pretty happy Coopersville students in uh, this house when they found out that there was a snow day. But Superintendent Matt Spencer says even with virtual learning as an option, they will still have snow days like today. While teachers did an amazing job shifting to virtual learning last year, making them change their lesson plans to virtual for one day is just too much. It's additional work. It's a change in planning and it's um, the, the sense of changing horses in midstream. Not every West Michigan district stayed home today. Forest Hills students reported to the classroom. But when the weather warrants it, Superintendent Dan Beam says that's one tradition he plans to keep. Snow days are are still with us. It is not something that, uh, not yet another thing that students have lost. 85% of their students chose an in-person learning option this year. If there were a snow day, both in-person and virtual students would have the day off. But one challenge, Beam says, to ignoring snow days and moving to virtual is equipment, which many students borrow from the district. Uh, those devices are in our schools right now. So to just simply say to kids, oh, you better take it home tonight because it may be a snow day tomorrow. We really haven't gotten into all of those logistical challenges. However, both superintendents said the door is not closed on virtual class being the new snow day. And there are conversations about how that could work one day. But while snow day policies vary from district to district, don't say goodbye to them just yet. If we saw a winter that really started to stack up snow days, we would look at uh, something more to extend our instructional time with uh, all the things we've learned about virtual learning. But for the time being, it will be a typical snow day as we've seen in previous years. Elena Holland, 13 on your side.